Hey everybody, once again, Miyuki here with Good Fortune Jewels on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. Welcome back. This is another Black Friday sales video for today's video. It is going to be short and long necklaces. Uh, totally majorly different, but not too different. So I'm combining both short and long necklaces. One that I'm going to be starting off with is pink and purple. So, here's one. Item number one. Let me grab this here. I totally forgot to do that first. So hopefully now you can have a better view of my videos now that I have lighting. Now that I have lighting on my videos, hopefully you are able to see them better. My items a lot more better. Okay, so this is item number one. Let me scoot over here so that way you can see it better. From a far distance and your up close point of view, it is actually very clear pink. So it's kind of a, like a light pink. Don't know if you can see that, but that is light pink. That chain. I'm just trying to make it look fancy for you guys here. So, I have a couple of chains in there by itself. So you have these ones by itself, and then you have your pink stones right in there, see-through, clear pink, and then your silver ball right in there. I want to say it's almost kind of a bit similar to a rosary, Catholic rosary. For those of you who may be Catholic, not hating, I'm Catholic too, no hate there, okay? So that's item number one. Let me put this back here because I might run out of space. Like you do not understand how I run out of space so fast on this table. Item number two. Yes, these are all adjustable. I wish I had something underneath here that can really show you guys. Okay, so this is item number two. This is more of a lighter pink, like uh, baby powder pink, if you will. Okay. So that is your piece right here. And just to show you the more up close details of this. If you're able to see that, I totally apologize if my lighting is throwing off the color. Let me tone it down. No, nope, that's too high. Okay, can you see that? the real true color of this thing okay there we go so that is your pastel pink okay baby powder pink if you want to call it that okay and yes these are adjustable they do have a clasp a little bit of an extension okay they all have the same type of extension so if you want to extend this a little bit more, maybe you got a longer neck or prefer it to be a little bit more longer, you can. And also, forgot to show you this part of the detail because it does have a wee bit of a heart to it. It has a small individual heart, okay? And just to show you the details, okay, just to show you. The more up close details. I know I turned off my light, but just so that you know what you are buying. Okay. Just so that you know what you are buying. You can see all the up close details to it. 
So that is item number two. Also forgot to mention. I always forget to mention the matching earrings with the things. The matching earrings. And just to show you, item number one for the matching earrings, in case you did not see them, which I should have did an up close version of it. These are your earrings. Okay. This suit also has a clasp and an extension. Your clasp and extension. Okay. Nickel and lead free for every one of them as always. So that's item number one and item number two. Item number three, we a bit more on the longer side, a little bit more on the bubbly side, a little bit more bubbles here. Fun bubbles. My light is off. Let me turn that back on. Okay, a little bit more and better. So, again, pastel pink is my shirt going out of hand here. I saw the tag to this thing. This thing keeps getting caught. Anywho, so that is item number three. A little bit more on the bubbly side a little bit. Your matching earrings. I'm sorry, my light is so bright, but I totally needed it. Okay, so let's try and work with this type of lighting. So you have your pastel pink. Better yet, let's turn that one off. So that way you can see what you are buying. Your pastel baby powder pink. Okay. Your details, your up close details, okay, so you know what you are buying. And then your long chain, Just to show you your up close details so you know what you are buying. Sorry for the sound effects here going on. Okay. And then your long chain at the bottom. This is item number three. There you go. So that is item number three. Just to bring it softer. Item number four has a tassel. Hold on one second before I put it right back up there. Let me just fix that tassel. Now this is very rosary light. Not that it is, it's not. But these are kind of a bit like the same type of beading that they would use, that Catholics would use on their rosaries. Let me just straighten that out so you can all see. Okay. And your tassel. Your matching earrings. I'm just going to leave the light on because I'm kind of tired of turning it on and off. So your pastel pink baby powder pink, kind of see-through, slightly see-through, but not all the way see-through. Like, it's kind of gemmy, if you will. Okay, so that is your details. And your other beading right here. Another type of beading right here. So it turns out it's just, are they rhinestones? Yes, they are rhinestones. So those are your rhinestones in the middle of your bead, so they would be hanging like this, and there's rhinestones all around, just like that. 
Okay, for both of them. That's just how they are for both of them. And then your tassel. So it's going to be that way all around. That is item number four. Item number five is more like a hot pink color because it's hot. Okay. I wish I had something to. Let me second just so you can all see this hopefully it doesn't make any sound I don't think so let's try it anyways yep totally works there we go we have a stand okay so I'm using my piggy bank as a stand now so hopefully you guys can see all the good details of this okay so that is your, and your bottom detail, just so you can see it, okay? And then just so you can see the chain detail, okay? So you have three strands of, on your chain, okay? Some of them have a ball. There's one of them that's just a plain chain with nothing on it, that's fine. And then your two other chains, I'm sure you can tell, okay, one chain, one strand of this one does have a ball and a circle, okay, whereas the other chain that's a more thicker chain looks more like this, okay, so that is your item number three. No, item number five. I'm sorry. I'm losing count already. That's item number five. Item number five. Item number six. Also another long chain. Hot pink beads. Let me scoot over this way. And kind of fix this one up. This is item number six. So you have a few pink balls at the top. So basically all it is is that the chain is inverted on one side. That's all it is. So same thing, just the other way around. And then your bottom chain, the bottom part of your chain, just to show you the details, has three strands, not two. Okay? So, three strands. Okay? That is your up close detail. Chains all the way down. Just right here at the bottom. So, it meets from this part here and this circle link part of the chain and your three balls. I'm forgetting to show you the earrings. Hello. Your matching earrings. I forgot to show you item number, the past item number, that one. So item number five. So that's item number five. This is item number six. Some of them may have similar earrings, which is fine. That item number seven. Three strand chain. Okay, so just to show you, one chain is like this. That's the first one. That's a short one. That's a short strand. The second strand is just going to be empty. Then your third strand. Okay, and it's 
kind of bit like hot pink, but a little bit more one shade darker. And then your matching earrings. Also clasp with extension. I'm sure you can see it. Up close details. So you know what you are buying. That's item number seven. Item number eight, a little bit more on the Jimmy side. Just one chain long necklace. Can you see that okay? So, just very long Jemmy necklace. So you got your, some squares, some teardrops. I'm sorry, that's an emerald cut. So you got a teardrop, a circle, and an emerald cut. And then your matching earrings look like this. Your up close details. So there you have your teardrop and circle, your emerald cut. And that's pretty much it. Just those three type of dis uh, cuts of for your stones. Oh my god. What happened? There it is. Did not know that fell over. Okay. So that was item number eight. Item number nine for the long necklaces. We might not have enough time to do the short necklaces because I have so many. So item number nine. Hold on a second. You have your extension and your clasp. Let me just adjust this. There we go. So, this is what it looks like from a distance. Okay. So, those are your purple stones and silver metal stones. Just so you can see the details all the way at the bottom. And once again, the matching earrings, purple stones, and your up close detail. That is item number nine. Item number ten, I think I'm just going to do these for long earrings, just like with the pink ones earlier. You have a purple, metallic purple. Is my chain? Yeah, you are off. A little uneven here. So, just to show you, so that is metallic purple. Okay, metallic deep purple, real nice color. Show again for a more. Closer detail. Okay, so you have your matching earrings right here. Metallic purple, deep metallic purple. Love it, like royal purple actually. Metallic royal purple and your up close details of your necklace so you know what you are buying. That is item number 10. Real nice one too. Item number 12, kind of similar to the ones earlier. Item number 11. Okay, you've got a couple of purple beads. Some of them are see-through purple. Okay. Don't know if you can see that right there. Perfectly fine. Okay. So just to have a more better... So that way you can see that part better. Come on. Your matching earrings. 
and then your up close detail of the necklace. Again, this is item number 11. You have four chain strands, four strands of uh, chains at the bottom here. Just to show you what it would look like. Okay. So the ch two chains start at two different balls. And then you have your four chains right there. Just to give you a better look. Okay, that is not a better look at that. Let me try to adjust this perfectly well for you. Just trying to make it look nice and fancy for you guys. That's all. So that way you know what you are buying. So just to show you what it looks like, what the chains look like. Okay, when they meet at the bottom here. Just to show you that part. Okay, so four chain, four strands of chains. That is item number 12. 11, I'm sorry. I'm losing count. <clears throat> this is item number 12. A little bit more on the longer side. Smaller uh, beading. One thing about this item. Hold on, is it even on right? Let me fix that part. Yeah. So you've got two strands. Two chain strands, okay. One of them, I just want to be able to show you what you are getting. So it is more on the kind of bit just like the metallic purple, but a little bit of a shade lighter. If you're able to see that, probably not with all that brightness going on. So, let me show you. Okay, so, your metallic purple matching earrings. Your two strands. And then your up close detail. Let me try and bring that up closer so you can see that. Because the, you got uh, some two silver balls on each pattern. It makes a pattern. You got your purple and then your two silver balls hanging underneath it. Just to show you a more up close detail so you know what you are buying. And then one thing that's also cool about this, you can hang your phone or keys, you know, uh, or your little uh, key cards on this. Yes, it does work. It does function just like a regular clasp. Okay. So yes, it does do that, but I would be careful of the weight that you, or the amount of, that you put in, so maybe a few keys and a few cards. So that is item number 12. That is item number 12. Item number 13, three strand, clear bead. I don't know if you can tell with that, but let me try to raise it up so you can see, have a better view of the bottom part of it. There you go. So that's your bottom part of your beading necklace. So it's kind of a bit like clear purple clasp with extension. And then your matching earrings. I don't know if you can see that. They are fish hook earrings. And then your up close detail of the necklace. So you know what you are buying. 
Okay. Or is that a number 13? My shirt go up right there. I'm like, why is this in the way? So, that is for, that is item number 13. My shirt keeps going up. I'm sorry. Okay, so that concludes my 1 through 14, 13, sorry, 1 through 13 long necklaces of pink and purple. Next video will be the short necklaces. So stay tuned for those. Till next time, I am out.